I uh, got approached by um, an associate professor in the biomedicine department who was actually interested in uh, me coming, coming over. Um, I think he, uh, he uh, sold that uh, extremely well to me and, and that's basically why I decided to come here. So very quickly on in the process, uh, I got in touch with uh, someone from the international office. I don't know if it's the correct word. Um, maybe I can cite her name. It's uh, Wiebeke. Um, and you know, I'm still in touch with her. I think I wrote her an email a few a few days ago about about an issue I had with SCAT. Uh, so no, extremely helpful. Uh, this was also part of our uh, decision, I think, to feel extremely well supported. You know, in the move back uh, uh, to Europe. So no, extremely good job from this international office and and from the great people that are working in uh, in this office. I did not know what Aarhus was before. Before coming here, I knew about Copenhagen, of course, but but Aarhus, uh, not much, and uh, and my first impression was was not necessarily a good one because uh, I landed at uh, Bilun Airport, and for about you know 45 minutes drive there was nothing around, so I was a bit uh, worried about what I will find in the end, but uh, but 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 in the end I'm extremely happy about about the life I have here now, you know, both uh, on, on the social side and also on on the professional side. Here the campus is is a very small campus. But, but it's, uh, it's a nice one. I think it's a nicely made one. We have nice buildings, good facilities. Um, no, I think it's, it's a very nice place to, to, to come on a daily basis. I think this is extremely different from, from what I've seen in other, in other places and especially in North America. First, I would say that I was kind of shocked when I started working in the lab, seeing that people that were living at uh, three or four in, in the afternoon. But then I realized that um, uh, there was much more than just work on a, on a daily basis and, and you know having this nice ratio between uh, spending time with my family my kids my wife and also having some some efficient time at work uh, was something that was actually looked for here in, in Denmark for someone who would decide to come here I think one of the first positive points is the fact that everyone is able to to speak and communicate with you in English which is yeah, I don't, I don't, I cannot think of any other place in Europe where it's really like that, where you can, you know, uh, talk in English and everyone will understand you. So, so that's that. That would be one piece of advice. Don't be afraid. You will be able to communicate if your uh, English skills are are good enough. So that would be a, a piece of advice. And, and the last piece of advice I would probably give is uh, buy a good uh, rain gears because it's uh, raining so much. That's that's probably the best. Uh, Best piece of advice uh, I would give, uh, be prepared, the weather is not good, but the rest uh, of the life is excellent. So.